You all are welcome to this video. Till now, we have learnt about graphical and algebraic methods of solving linear equations in two variables. Today, we will learn how to solve equations reducible to a pair of linear equations in two variables. In your class, five boys and two girls do their homework together in four days. Whereas, the same homework is done by two boys and one girl in nine days. If one boy and one girl together have to do the homework on their own, how many days will they take to finish it? Can you write a pair of linear equation in two variables? to represent this situation? Let's make a pair of equations. Let's assume that a boy takes x days to finish this work on his own and a girl takes y days to finish the work on her own. Hence, in one day a boy finishes 1 by x amount of work and a girl finishes 1 by y amount of work in one day. Therefore, Work done by five boys and two girls in a day. And we can similarly write the work done by two boys and one girl in a day. Now we get equations 1 and 2. Can you solve this pair of equations? If we write both these equations in the following manner, you can see that here we get a pair of equations but this is not in the form of linear equations because in this the equation ax plus by plus c is not equal to zero which is why it becomes difficult to solve this equation. So let us see how this pair of equations can be solved easily. In order to solve this type of a pair of equations, we can express them in the form of linear equations in two variables. To do this, if we replace 1 by x by m and 1 by y by n in equations 1 and 2, then we get equations 3 and 4. In this manner, we have expressed equations 1 and 2 in the form of linear equations. Now, we can solve equations 3 and 4 by either graphical or algebraic method. Pause the video and try to solve this. When we solve the pair of equations, we get the value of m as 1 by 36 and n as 1 by 18. But, can you tell what do we need to do in order to find the values of x and y? Because we assumed 1 by x as m and 1 by y as n. So now, when we replace 1 by x as m and 1 by y as n, we get x is equal to 36 and y is equal to 18. Therefore, to finish the homework, one boy will take 36 days and one girl will take 18 days. In this video, we learned how to express a pair of equations which is not linear as a pair of linear equations and solve them. We'll look at some examples based on this in the next video.